Okay, raw and uncut video of Ghana braids or feeding feeding cornrows, something like that. It has a lot of name to it, but in this video, I'll show you how to do these. We are using this hair. It's 84 inches, 82. It's 82 inches. I don't know how many packs I'm using yet. yet. You'll see how many I use in the edited video. And what I did with this hair is just take it off the pack. If you are allergic to synthetic hair, of course, you're going to soak it in apple cider vinegar before you use it. I'm used to doing her hair, so she, I know she's not allergic to it. But, uh, this is how the hair would look like. And what we'll, I would do is cut it right here. Okay, once I'm done cutting it, I'll take half of it. Let me take half of it. Half of it. Okay, this should be half of it. Oh, Lord. Okay, there you go. Half of it. What I would do with that half is split it, split it into three. See how it look like? Uh, in order for you to split it into three equally, you just have to fill the hair. Then you'll feel that if all three are the same size. Let me start by doing this. And you just feel it. You keep feeling it to see if all three are exactly the same size. This one is a little thinner. I'll just take a little bit and keep feeling it. Mm. Okay. The middle is still a little thicker. You cannot really see it, but if you feel the hair, you'll see that one is actually thicker or too thick than the other keep filling the hair let me see this one is still thinner just thick okay so you have three of it that one is for one braid you would split that one into two i'm gonna be doing a lot of math in this video you split this into two exactly you want eight a strand out of this let me so let me show you those a strand those eight right here you take this and split it into eight how you do it is split it into two first you and you keep filling it split it into two this one will become four and this one will become four so you split this into two again and you keep filling it okay this is two you split this into two and you keep filling it you split that one into two okay that's four of them and you put it on her just to make it easier hmm. i'll just lay them there on her like that that's four of them we just have to do another four and then we'll be ready. This one will become four. So we split it into two. And you keep filling it. Make it equal. You split this one into two. And this one into two. Now you have eight strength to work with. That's not the exact math for all of them. But for the size that I'm doing, that's how I end up with it this size that's how i end up with this size and that's how i end up with it looking so neat that's what i did okay to start the braid now we are using eight strand let me turn the camera right here what i did to her hair is preparing the pattern we want eight 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 big cornrows going straight back so what i did i Hold on. Oh, 
Okay, let's have one. What's up, me too? What I did, I parted her hair in the middle. What? My camera's dying. Part the hair in the middle, and then I did four here, and I did four there. You'll see that part in the edited version of the video. And as soon as I did this, I just looked at the front, see if everything is um oh Lord, uniform, if everything is the same size. And then I start uh, working. Now we'll do the second one. <sighs> when you're doing the second one, you have to undo the third one as well. Because when I parted mine like that, they were not neat. I just want to know how they're going to look up front, but the back is not that neat. So I'll undo this and make this part neat. <sighs> Let me undo this. Let's see, six minutes, that's not bad. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna part this one better. See right here, it's not uh, it's not perfect yet. I'm just gonna fix it. No, je peine en moi. Peine. Pas bouger toi, non, vous bagayez chez vous. Okay, let me fix this right here. Not too much. Let me fix it. Let me fix it in the back. Let me fix it here. I think it's neat enough. And this one, I'll just uh, take a rubber band or anything. Just leave it on this side so it can be out of the way. Oh, the rubber band will. Huh? Oh, well, I don't know. Hold on, hold on. Go ahead, one. Well, I couldn't find a rubber band. I'll just um, do some braid with that. Come on, Fevaka, well, love me. Hey, go to the Okay, I'll use a comb oh, to get it out of the way. Let me use that comb and get it out of the way. Okay, it's out of the way. I couldn't find the rubber band. Now I'm gonna go ahead and detangle our hair. And what I did on her, uh, what I use on her scalp is uh, coconut oil and peppermint oil. coconut no? <laughs> go ahead. There you go. Okay, I use this on her scalp. Uh, virgin coconut oil mixed with peppermint oil. <sighs> and then let me just detangle her hair. Detangle. Okay. Now I'm ready to start. When you're starting... Uh, the braid. You're gonna take one of out of the eighth one you had. Take one of these. Like I said, we'll be doing a lot of math here. I'll be saying a lot of one, two, one, two. You take this and split it into four. The very first one is not gonna be as as um uh, as proportional as the other three. So the first one will be will be thin. You take the first one and you save it and this one will become three and you just make them the same size it's not gonna be a big deal they all three are the same size over moment just over and I have her hold them for me okay yeah 
she's holding them here now let's get started to start I just use this this will be two strand and one one um, I'll use the third strand will be the beginning of her hair this will be the third strand let's get started let me zoom it a little bit mm -hmm. okay see I, I now just start here I just start the corner two three four and I just add one I'm adding one strand here one and two now I just slip this in the back here one and two let's see no we didn't come out right we have to start over oh lord take the first one this will become the the third uh, leg right here and then we start again and do this one again one and two one and two so i corner this six times comparing to this one i did this on uh four times this one is six times i'll just uh take one of the three um strand we had and use it here under my finger right here Let's see yeah you do one and two slip it underneath one and two it's time for the other one one and two right after you have it here it's time to con roll two times before you add the next one one and two now you can add the next one somewhere in there I'm gonna add the next one okay it's underneath it right here and I'm gonna corner two times before I add another strand one sorry two now it's time to add um, one of the seven strand I have left we add one here that's one of them See? one and two slip this underneath I'm gonna corner two times before I add the uh, one of the six one left one and two time to add one let me add it now i have it here one Let's see if it's filming oh lord i'm back with camila sulina woman two This thing is not easy to upload. Mm. Okay. Add one here. Okay. See how 
me this is coming time to add another one right here Okay, but I'm gonna get them up. We have two more, then we'll be done. And have it underneath. And we break two times before we add the next one. One, two. Now it's time to add the, uh, the last one. Let's add it. Okay, it goes underneath. Okay. And you just braid all the way down. It's almost 20 minutes. Uh, I'll try to explain better in the edited version of it. We'll see. Right here. And what I did, I just um, braided it all the way down until we get that look. The video is already long. I don't want to braid it all the way down in this video. So I'll do that in the next one. But leave your question down below and I'll make sure I respond to them. And if um, if the ends look too blunt, like right here, take a razor comb and comb this out. I don't have a razor comb, but I do have a um, Oh, okay. I do have a blade. Yeah, I do have this. I just take it and and use it right here and make it thinner so I can have that look. If you don't want to do that, right after you cut the hair, what you can do is where is it? Right after you cut the hair, what you can do is take your time. I hate doing this. That's why I didn't do it. Take your time and then keep pulling these. Keep pulling, keep pulling until you have thin ends. Or just use your razor comb at the end so you can have this. Because I did this using your, uh, my my blade. And it worked. I'll see you in my next video.